To calculate the average velocity of the object between two points, we have to wait some time. But most of the time, we don't care about the velocity of the object, average velocity between any two points, but rather we want to know the velocity of the object instantly. So this requires a new definition of velocity, which is the instantaneous velocity. And in fact, it is nothing but the limiting value of the average velocity. You know, delta x divided by delta t is average velocity and it requires uh, two different points both in position and time um, but for instantaneous velocity what we do is mathematically we just take the limiting value of this ratio when this interval delta t goes to zero